hello everyone welcome back to manjunath priya tutorials in this video i will be sharing you a passage a story which contains 220 basic side words these side words are known as high frequency words these words will be repeatedly uh, you can see these words repeatedly very often and in any story if you read any book any book no, normally this uh, words mean this words are high frequency words are used very very often okay repeatedly we use these words 220 words uh, yellow is for um, um, kid, uh, lower kindergarten blue is for the blue colored words okay highlighted words or for upper kindergarten and the gray ones are for grade 1 students and the purple ones are for grade uh, two students and green ones are for the grade three students okay uh, these uh, uh, they should know these side words okay if you, if you read the story to your children or if your student is watching if you read the story you will be knowing all the 220 basic side words no need to blend and read all these side words children because it is very difficult to each and everything if you go on blending am am it's not going to work out okay these side words you should know read the story again and again and again and again so that uh, you will uh, have grip over your basic side words 220 side words let us start without wasting time the best thing in the world is the title of the story uh so let me read the story Once upon a time there were four brothers who lived in a far away land their father was an old king one day he said i will not live long now today you must start out into the world in a year bring back the best thing you have found the one who picked the best thing shall be the new king the first brother said i will look in every city or town I will buy the best thing I can for my father. The next two brothers said, "We will both go on a fast ship over the sea. We will find something better." The last brother said, "I am going to ask the people here in our own land to tell me the best thing." The other three brothers began to laugh. "Then you will never be a, then you'll never be king," they said. The last brother started off. When he had gone about six miles, he met a man. "What do you carry in those big bags?" he asked. "The best thing in the world," said the man. "These are full of good nuts, which fall from my five nut trees. I don't think that. So, I don't think that would work," said the brother to himself. I must try again. The brother went on another seven miles. Miles. He found a small brown bird. It had been hurt, so he put it in his coat, where it could keep warm. As he went on, he saw a little girl crying. He ran to meet her. "Why are you crying?" he asked. "I want to get some water from the well," she said. We use so much. We drink cold water. We wash the clothes clean with the hot water. But uh, I do not know how to pull it up. Please show. Please show me. The brother said, "Hold this bird, and I will help you. It does not fly around any more because it got its wing cut." Thank you. What a pretty bird," she said. I wish you would give it to me. If you will let me keep it, I will always be very kind to it. I will take care of it myself. I will make it grow well again. Yes, you may have it," said the brother. So uh, he gave her the bird and went on. At night, he went to sleep under a, a round yellow haystack. When it was light again, he walked on. Every day he would walk eight or ten miles. He asked the people about the best thing in the world. Some said it was best to sing. Uh, some said it was best to run and jump and play. 
some said the green grass was best some liked the red and blue and white flowers best one man said the best thing was to ride a black horse he always stopped to help people who needed it soon he made many friends all the people began to like him they would say see there goes the king's son he would be just the right kind of king for us every door was open to him the people would call to him a uh, call to him to stop they would ask him to come and eat with them after he ate he would sit down and read to the children after he re- read he showed them how to draw and write months went by he still had no beautiful thing to take to his father just before the year was done he went home again the time came when the king called his sons together what did you bring he asked them all the other brothers had many beautiful things and what did you bring said the king to the last brother this is too funny said the other brothers he has nothing but the king was kind to the last brother what did you bring me the king asked again i bring only the friendship of your people said the last brother that is the best thing cried his father you shall be the new king at the end this is a simple passage children so yellow i as i told you earlier yellow words yellow highlighted words of our lower kindergarten blue highlighted words of our upper kindergarten if you are in upper kindergarten you must know all these words if you are first graders you must know the gray colored words you must know the gray colored side words if you are second grade if you are second grade children kid and you are watching this you must know all the words which are highlighted in green the purple ones if you are third grade students you, you must know the purple words all these two 20 words are very 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 important uh, so it will be it will not look nice if you don't know these uh, these because it, it, it this is very used i mean frequently used words children so you read this uh, I, my recommendation is to read this passage again and again and again over again so that um, you you know all the 220 basic side words and children if you want you can take a uh, uh, screenshot of this three pages okay uh, of this passage and in order to read or you can download it from the google if you type uh, 220 uh, basic sight words dolch 220 dolch basic sight words story in color if, if you type no you will get definitely you will get this pdf the pdf is uh, available in google thank you very much for for your patience this is very important sight words are very important in order to improve your confidence um, in order to improve your um, um, confidence okay reading confidence okay you can read confidently the the other words you can blend and read okay l as to lash bro or the or brother or the other words you can blend and read but you should not uh, um keep on blending these sight words because it will it is because it is repeating again and again you must memorize it so that is what i want to tell you thank you very much for your patience for watching this video have a great day bye 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 bye